Have you ever wondered if everything around you, the sky, the stars, even your thoughts, might not be real at all? What if our universe is just a simulation running on someone else's computer? This idea isn't new. In 2003, Oxford philosopher Nick Bostrom proposed that if advanced civilizations can create conscious simulations, then we're probably already inside one. For them, running entire worlds could be as simple as pressing start think about it. The deeper scientists look, the more digital the universe seems. Space and time appear to be made of tiny, indivisible pixels, the Planck scale. Below it, nothing exists. It's as if reality has a built-in screen resolution. Quantum physics makes things even stranger. Particles behave like code, switching between states, on and off, just like binary data. They don't even exist until they're observed, as if the universe renders itself when someone's watching. Some researchers suggest that the random noise we detect at the quantum level might be the static of the code, the tiny glitches of a cosmic computer. If that's true, then matter, energy, and even your mind could all be part of one vast calculation. So who runs the simulation? A future civilization studying its past? Or perhaps an intelligence beyond our comprehension? Maybe we're digital ghosts, replayed memories of beings long gone. And what about free will? Are our choices real? Or are we just following algorithms that make us believe we decide? If every thought is code, freedom itself might be the most elegant illusion ever written. Perhaps reality isn't physical, it's informational. The universe could be mathematics experiencing itself. So next time you look up at the stars, remember, they might not be burning suns at all, but pixels, glowing fragments of a perfect simulation.